You'll notice on the back and front, I have cloud wheels for my wonder. In today's video, I'm going to show you exactly how to install these cloud wheels. Two wheels for the front, two wheels in the back. Here's my 96 millimeter wheel, and here is the 105 millimeter cloud wheels. Look how much wider, much wider too. Looks like they're going to go in. Nice and quiet. Now for the real deal the hub motors. Carefully go into one of the slits. And very carefully, once you're in there, just lift it up. Like I'm doing right here. There it comes. Right off. The hub should just slide right off. There it comes. Right off. Now, as I put the wheel on, I'm going to use an aux auxiliary screw. It'll go in, and then this will line up with that. Watch. I'll just put this on. And it looks good up there. Okay, and I'll put this in, and now you can see the auxiliary screws coming in, and I just about have it lined up, so I just got to turn the wheel just a little bit, okay, turn the wheel just a little bit, and now I can turn in the screw, there you go, and that's lined up, do the next auxiliary screw, we'll do, uh, I'll do this one, same thing, line it up, now that the wheel's in, Okay, and the screw's on, push the wheel in. So that's about as far as I'm able to push it in at the moment. It's not going in any further. Oh, there we go. So I had to push that on really tight. Okay, take this out. And take this one out too, don't want to get, everything's on. Take one of my little screws, put it in. Put that right through the top. Make sure that the washer's in there. The washer fell off just now. So I had to push it in, and now it's coming on. I can feel it tightening up now. There we go, it's getting tighter. There. Good. And that's on. When I put these screws in, they're not in all the way, so I gotta push this down even more. There. It's still kinda high up. Push it down. There. So I should see all the screws come through. I start to see the bolt now. I don't see it. I see it a little bit. I don't see much vibration at all. In fact, I would say I got the wheels on. Correct the window. My old backfire wheels. I can now store them in the I Wonder Discovery Cloud Wheels box. And now I've got an all new. <laughs> Ready to ride Outback style wheels, cloud wheels, so I can ride over any kind of terrain. But just how good are these cloud wheels? How well do they really work? Stick around because I'm going to take these on a whole lot of different trails and different paths. And we're going to test them out and see just how good they really are. I hope you found this instructions video helpful. If you did, please comment below and let me know. And please like and subscribe. Also, if you're thinking about buying these, I do have the direct links below. So check that out. And again, I'm Tom Jordan. Thanks for watching. Talk to you guys next time. I do have a second part to this video. I do have the dark links for you below if you want to pick these up. These are brand new.